Hey guys, April 15th, 8.30, so I wasn't going to do a video, but I am just literally got out of the shower and got changed, and I'm still really red, so if you could see, I don't know if you could tell in the video, but I'm red all around here, up to here, it's puffy, my arms are really puffy and red, like I said, I don't know if you could see in the video, but that's why I'm going in the bathroom, so the lighting is kind of better. So yeah, whenever I get, whenever I'm in the sun, if I'm in the water for the heat, if I'm in a uh, sauna, my, if I'm in the sauna, my whole body goes red and pudgy. So that's why I'm like, I don't know if I'm allergic or what, but <laughs> yeah, it's really weird. It's always been like this. So that's why my body does not do well in the cold, but that doesn't mean that I don't wear my heated jacket and I don't wear my sweater. But yeah, that's what I have to deal with all the time. So I hate, 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 hate the sun. Um, I know there's a lot of people who have conditions when they can't be in the sun. So I don't know if I have that, but like I said, whenever I'm in, uh, I take a hot shower and then a cold shower, and I'm still like this. So I always do a cold shower right after a hot shower. Just a quick one. Just to see if it makes a difference. But it doesn't. So I don't know if anybody else has that issue. But I have. I do know a few people who say that their bodies go all red. Like it's close up. <laughs> I don't know if you could actually see how red it is in the camera. But yeah, to me, when I look at it, I'm like, holy Moses, like, especially the side right here, it's so red. It's kind of gross. <laughs> so that's why I decided to do a video, but I have been shaking. So I'm going to, I took my medication already, and I'm going to go to bed early tonight. But like I said, I wasn't going to do a video, but <laughs> I also told you guys what my body is like during the heat, so I don't know like, if you could see it there, but I know in the photos it comes up, the red, so I'll post the photos, but yeah, I always had that problem, always, 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 and a lot of times when it's hot out, I'm like freaking cold, <laughs> and when it's cold, I'm freaking hot, so it's really weird, but yeah, I just took a shower, so I was like, oh, I don't want to really do a video, but just want to share that. So yeah, sucks. Because it's like, I really do sometimes wish I could be out in the sun all day. I just can't because of my body. So that's why, another reason why I stopped doing the ghost storytelling, because it's easier to film when it's hot outside, but then my body does not like that, so, <laughs> so I go, the best season for me is like winter or just before, uh, what do you call it, <clears throat> just before winter, after the summer, I guess, uh, August, September, I guess that's August, September, like my birthday, around there, so I usually go to Victoria for my birthday, so then I can do stuff, but, yeah, it's just, uh, even my hands are red, and I've been shaking, I don't know if you can see it on my fingers, yeah, I've been shaking a lot, so that's why I go, I know I overdid myself this weekend, so Monday, so Monday I always go to bed early, but yeah, it's like, I'm just so tired, so tired, but I'm gonna eat my, half my sandwich that's left, and the uh potatoes that i made the other day like a log <laughs> i haven't been wanting potatoes but i also don't want them to go bad so i'm kind of forcing myself to eat them so yeah i just have uh my bowl of potatoes with vegan butter on it i made this a while back but i'm just gonna i had it in the freezer and then i'm just gonna microwave them and then i have my sandwich Half my sandwich. Oh, yeah. Can't grab it out. <laughs> Too tired. So, just remember, I also live alone. So, that's what I try to say that more often now. Because people are like, oh, why do you get so personal? Why do you talk about your life and what you do? 
because I'm alone and I gotta look after myself and I know there's looking after yourself is pretty much a full-time job a lot of people don't understand that especially when you have conditions like I only did uh, the cutlery that's there that's all the dishes I did and I've been soaking the rest and then vacuumed and put things away and that's all literally all that I've been doing today pretty much other than smoking when even though it's not long so but that's why I got I'm warped out <laughs> from this week so yeah I'm probably gonna do another short before I go to bed because I haven't been doing too many videos today and I kind of like to inspire other people now before I go to sleep saying stuff to remind them and remind myself that looking after yourself is a full-time job when you have conditions so do what you can day by day <laughs> and my place is it was messy but it's not so bad now so it's getting there one one day at a time so um, once again, daily vlogger. Also, because I live alone, it helps to like have extra support that I can talk to people who are living the way that I am, or we're trying to do as much as we can before we have to fall asleep. <laughs> and it's like all the cough in the world will not make me stay awake right now. Same with the uh, energy pills that I have. I don't take them until when I know I'm not so tired and like I said my hands are all red and everything's keeping allergic <laughs> I don't know I just say allergic now because it pretty much is allergic reaction to heat so I don't know if I am going to go do the sauna thing but I still want to get my car renewed probably going to do that on Wednesday after the hall gas museum because it's uh, close by on the Canada line but We'll see. But yeah, call you tonight. So I'll do a short and uh, talk to you guys next time I'm awake. I'll probably end up getting up like around 2 or 3 like I usually do when I go to bed at around 9. But sometimes I don't get up till the next day too. So it's always a mystery. <laughs> Unless if I have to be up like on Thursdays and I have like my alarm set. But if I don't, then I just... Listen to my body, and uh, I enjoy sleeping, so I'll talk to you guys later. I'm going to do a short, and yeah, call me tonight. You're on Phantom Stories. <laughs>